Hi, so today I'm going to be talking about how to use the arrange function in the dplyr package to order a data frame. And I did a video a while back, but it's pretty outdated by now, and this way is a lot easier, so I'll show you how to do it. And we're going to use um, the Cars93 data set from the mass package. And just a heads up if you want to recreate this, you're going to want to make sure you load up mass before dplyr because there is a function in um, mass that is has the same name as one in dplyr and so you're not going to be able to do it, use the one in dplyr if it, they're the other way around okay so I named it auto and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn it into a local data frame and then I'm also just going to and I'll print that out real quick Okay, so here's a local data frame. So I only want to, and I'm going to use chaining here. So I'm only going to want to take from this data set, I want the manufacturer and the model, and let's see, say mpg.city. And Okay, and then we could look at our auto here again. Okay, so we have this here. Now, um, pretty cool feature in dplyr is to use a range function, which is a lot better than you've seen the bracket notation and then order, and it gets really clunky if you do it that way. So I'll first order it by. Uh, manufacturer and then model and then as you can see here let's go ahead and print a little bit more too okay so as you can see here now um, when I ordered it by manufacturer and then model we have the manufacturers are in alphabetical order and then within that the models are in alphabetical order and this, if you see this right here, this 190, if you're wondering why these aren't switched right here, it's because it's the way the data was input. It, this is an ordered factor. So this is going, the 100 comes before the 90, um, just due to that. And then we come here, and so everything's there. And as you can tell already, it's a lot easier to do than the order. Now let's do, um, let's order by this MPG. Um, city so there's two ways you can do this this way I'm going to do first this will order it in uh, ascending order so from lowest to highest w which oh whoops okay so this is lowest to highest which you know may or may not be what you want but if you want it from highest to lowest or in descending order just wrap your uh, column around this descending with this DESC inside the range and then there you go and let's get a little bit more here and there it is alright that's it thanks